Good afternoon, members. My name is Mark McManus. I'm General President of the United Association of Plumbers and Pipe Fitters, and congratulations on 30 years. I think the state of the industry that we're in is uh, spectacular in certain ways. The, the amount of work that is uh, across our two nations in Canada and the United States is almost unprecedented. Uh, the real trick is the supply chain, and the real trick is supplying skilled, qualified manpower. That's the hiccup, but it's uh, sort of the best of times and the worst of times all meeting at the same time, uh, and then plus the innovation of the mechanical industry that we're sitting right in the middle of. So it's uh, certainly exciting times for everyone that's part of the industry. The UA spends 250 million to 300 million a year on education. So I think our folks are at the top of the heap on, on everything that we do in the mechanical industry and every facet that we touch there, including the codes and, and being part of that code where we have good codes is where we have good projects, and I think the UA's input is invaluable on all those things. Dialogue. Sometimes there's always not consensus on every change in a code or where the code is going, but if you have the smart folks in the room from all sectors of the industry, I think just leads to good consensus going out and you build from there. And as you want to make a, maybe a change and change in life, if you change slowly sometimes, it becomes more palatable. So I think, I think change is coming and we have to embrace it. We believe the stronger the codes, the better the codes, the better the buildings, the better for society in general, and better for legitimate contractors that are building the, these, these projects. I'm a strong believer in codes, always have been, and I think the codes is the lifeblood of any project. My advice to ICC or anyone that's, that's growing a business, 30 years is a wonderful milestone, but continue to adapt. Don't let your traditions get in the way of progress. Traditions are wonderful, but sometimes traditions have to be eradicated for the future. You have to embrace fabrication, modularization, all the changing technologies, BIM and CAD, everything that's coming our way. We may not like it uh, at different levels, but if that's where the industry's going, you have to be flexible, and that would be my advice, and I think the UA has been flexible, and I think the ICC going forward should be flexible.